So, this week's episode of Yuna and the Antin Hot Spring show us that Kokoriashi have a whole lot of, yes, a whole lot of self-control because these erotic scenes that we saw in this week's episode will drive anyone crazy. Imagine if this happened to you right in front of you and you do the do and you didn't do anything. The only thing you can do is watch and you're watching it. And this is keep on happening over and over again. Now, in this week chapter or this week episode, Kogarashi meet two girls or two two of the protagonists of this series. He meet Chisaki, who was going through a whole lot of things, who was showing him erratic scene from erratic scene from the first time they meet to the last time they meet in the episode. So it was going around, it was going around because Ch um, Chisaki was saying that she was, her room was possessed by something. Something was possessing her room and because of this, because her room was possessed, she couldn't sleep, she couldn't do anything. So she invited Kogarashi, but because Yuna was there, Kogarashi always go into, uh, he always go into some kind of problem or get into some kind of problem with you not around. And with you not around, you should expect erratic scene. Now, the person that was giving Chi, the person that was giving Chisaki a whole lot of problem was a young girl, a young Tanuki who can transform into a girl. Her name is Ko Ko. Let me see. Kuyo Kuyozo or Kuyu Kuyozo, something like that. Kuyozo. Yeah. Her name was Kuyozo because her name was Kuyozo. She was actually a young Tanaki who can transform. The only reason she was possessing or or looking or making trouble with Chisaki uh, it was only because of her boobs. Yes. This young Tanaki wanted to look at Chisaki boobs to get them herself. Now, it was an exciting episode. Way too erratic. Or was it erratic enough? It was so fun that I was so excited to see it. Subscribe if you feel like it. Like the video if you feel like it. Thank you for watching. Hope to see you again.